hi friends, it's Hood again. Today I'm going to tell you an amazing, cool, inspiration story called Mr. King's Things by Jenna Wife Cote. Mr. King likes new things, lots of new things. As soon as one of his things becomes the tiniest bit old, he tosses it into the nearby pond and replaces it with a new one. The pond isn't isn't big, but it can fit loads and loads, and nothing ever shows except for a few ripples. When he isn't buying new things or tossing old things, Mr. King goes fishing. There aren't many fish, but Mr. King doesn't mind. He just likes to lie in the sun. But this morning, Mr. King is almost rocked out of his boat by a sudden tug. Uh Uh-oh, this must be a really big, big fish. He pulls on his line. And up comes the scariest looking thing Mr. King has ever seen. Ah! Help! A monster! Mr. King rows away fast as he can, but the monster is hooked to his line and, and it follows him closely. It follows him right into the shore. The minute that his boat lands, Mr. King runs for cover and sits tight. I shut hands on ears. His friends come rushing, rushing over to the shore, to the pond. Mr. King is nowhere to be seen. What was all the noise? Is the circus in town? Is it some sort of sing-along? Is there a sucky game? Did someone call our names? Mr. King's friends look around for a clue and find a big pile of things jumbled on the shore. A jumble sale, cries Harriet. I love jumble sales. I could use this letter, says Bert. I'm not really good at climbing trees. Ooh, what a lovely house, says Skit and Scat. Let me fix um, this umbrella up for you, Herbert offers old Jim a look. Now I'll, I'll have enough chairs to sit my whole family, explained PJ, and I'll take a table for two, says Tix. Mr. King is still hiding, wondering where the monster is. When he peeks to look, he spots his friends standing by the pond. Oh no! He runs over to warn them. Watch out! There's a monster over there! Watch out! Mr. King stops short. The monster is gone? Look, says Skit, we have a table, a teapot, six chairs, a tuba, and we saved some nice things for you too, says Skit. Mr. King turns quite red. Uh Uh-oh, he says, these are my old things. He picks up a few pieces thoughtfully. Hmm, I have an idea, he announces, and he sets off to work. Everyone is thrilled with Mr. King's new invention. He has made a flower kite, a fish castle, a floating fountain, a colorful surfboard, and a ferry boat for two. Mr. King likes to turn old things into new. The end. Guys, I hope you love the story, and it's my favorite story too. If you guys have a favorite story you can or a chapter, you can write in the title in the comments, and I'll be able to read it to you. Don't forget to hit the bell button, subscribe to my channel, give a thumbs up, and I'll see you in the next episode.